Pine actually arrests have started. You can see the folks over here. There's about three or four people who are refusing to leave. They're upset about the external gas regulators that are being installed on historic homes here. So they've been blocking EGE workers from doing their job since about 7 a.m. this morning. Police officers have been going back and forth speaking with these folks. They've given them three warnings and those warnings are up. They are now being arrested. You can see one of the main protesters there, Thiru Vignaraja, a lawyer, is representing them. He's here with them. We've seen one person arrested so far. This is the second individual to be arrested. Uh, we're told that this has to do with a trespassing charge and blocking a utility from doing their work. You can see that they are being loaded into the wagon right now. This is Maggie. She is another protester. And all of these women, we have three so far. Hey, Maggie, do you want to say anything? Brooklyn Gas and Electric should be ashamed of themselves. This is an abomination. And they know it. That was Maggie just now. We spoke with her previously about what's going on here. She is very upset about these external gas regulators being put in place. She is one of the protesters. She's been here all day. So you heard that message from her. I need somebody else to take it. They're all getting very upset here as they're being loaded into the wagon here. They have been having civil discourse throughout the day with police, but you can see it is obviously very heated right now. This is just outside Federal Hill Park. In fact, I'm standing in Federal Hill Park right now. This is where we're at. In Federal Hill, you can see police officers. Again, they've given them a few warnings. This, up. this deserves to be blown up. BGE is a predatory company. Media, get it done for us. Three people right now being arrested for trespassing and blocking a utility from doing work. We have dozens of BGE workers standing on the side here. They have not been able to work since 7 a.m. this morning. They've been standing around waiting to do work. Uh, we did speak with BGE in a statement today. They told us uh, that, of course, they are aware of what is going on here. Keep it real. Do you want to say anything? Through anything you can say right now, as three people are being arrested. Um, this is one of the most sickening scenes I have seen in Baltimore. Um, BG and &E ought to be embarrassed and ashamed of itself. Uh, I don't blame the people out here that are supposed to be doing the work. I'm embarrassed at the idea that BG and &E had enough political muscle that it could snap its fingers, get an extended permit, and order a platoon of police officers in a police force that is depleted to come down and arrest three women, handcuff them for what exactly? For trying to stop bg and &E from turning an old man's gas off. And what did he do wrong? He pays his bills, he cleans his house, he is a citizen, a model citizen. What did he do wrong? He didn't want bg and &E to drill into the marble facade of his home to put on an external regulator so that bg and &E could pad its profits. And for that, they got arrested. We don't, we don't have cops enough for carjackers and killers, but for three women that were trying to stand up for their community and protect the historic character of Baltimore, all of Baltimore, um, BG&E ought to be ashamed of itself. And uh, this ought to be as clear a signal as anyone needs to see about the disproportionate power that this utility company has in the city, the way they abuse it, the way they have politicians on strings. It is, I, I've never seen anything like it. People have called around this city for years asking for open air drug markets to be cleaned up, for uh, carjackers and killers to be addressed, to be addressed in a platoon all day. There were what, 20 officers, uh, brass, rank and file all out here today to make sure that bg and &E could do its precious work of turning a paying citizen's gas off because the, he didn't want them to drill into his house. Thank you for real.
So again, you can see that we have the police vehicles here. Again, three women have been arrested at this very moment. BGE is starting work again. They have been waiting since 7 a.m. to do this. Now, what the rule was mentioning there is that they're not only protesting the installation of these external gas regulators, they're also upset because they say some of their neighbors have had their service shut off for not allowing the regulators to be installed. So that is why they're protesting today. Of course, we are going to have much more on this as this has escalated throughout the day. But for now, live in Federal Hill, I'm Tommy Clark, WBAL-TV 11 News.